Right now, one of the busiest intersections in downtown Niles is shut down. It's all because of a huge water main break. If you're in that area, you need to pay attention to this story. We have First News Evening anchor Dave Seth live at that messy scene, new at noon. Dave, what's happening? Well, this is Park in Maine, and this is a, having a wide ranging impact. I'll explain it to you. A mile in that direction at the intermediate school, they're having low water pressure. Two miles in that direction at Austin Town Warren Road, they're also reporting some low water pressure. But here's the epicenter of where this break is. In fact, from the backhoe you see here to the water coming out to this orange cones, about 20 feet, that's where they've narrowed down this break to. What you're seeing come out is just excess water that's uh, in this hole that they're pumping out. But if you don't know it, water moves through water lines underground because of pressure. Let me show you what it looked like earlier this morning around 8.15 when this was called in. That pressure, there was a break in the line and that water was coming out from underground. Now, there is an assumption that this is a 24-inch water, water main line, but once they get underground, they think it could be just an 8-inch line. They won't know for a while now until they can safely get down there and inspect this line. But it's causing some problems. They believe that the pressure should be building up in those outlying areas, but as of right now, that pressure is going to remain low, if not off, in this downtown area while they fix this line. What's it affecting? Farmers National Bank over here on the corner of Park in Maine. It is open, but there's uh, unfortunately it's blocked off in a two block area here. There's not much business going on because people would have to walk. This building you're seeing now, the Niles Professional Building, it has about five to six inches of water in its basement because there was a little crack down there that needs to be sealed. And coming up during First News at 5 and 6, we'll tell you how this has all changed the business plan today for Core Temps, which is trying to find people new jobs. Live in Niles, Dave Sess, WKBN 27 First News.